Jane. Hi. Hi. Could I see you in my office for a moment? Uh, yes, of course. Can I just finish this up really quick? Absolutely. Okay. You know what? Place them on hold. Just for a sec. Thanks. Uh, so, I am almost finished with the Excel spreadsheet. Can't Jane, it's not about line. that. This isn't easy, but we've decided to let you go. The corporate has been making drastic cuts across the board, and fortunately, you're one of our new hires. Oh, um, Carrie, I really need this You've job. been doing amazing work, and I'm happy to write you a fantastic letter of recommendation. But I am going to need you to clean out your desk by the end of the day. I'm sorry, Jane. It's nothing personal. <laughs> Everybody loves you around the office. If I could afford to keep you on, I would. You've been doing fantastic work, and I'm happy to let you out. Unemployment. I don't want any of this. I know, Jane, but this happens to everybody. No, I will find something else. Right, but it's. Mom, it. please stop. I'm just trying to help, Jane. Well, you're not right now, okay? Yes, I am calling in regards to the job posting online. Is the receptionist position still open? Is there any chance you're still looking for an assistant? Okay. Hi, yes, uh, is the front desk position still open? Oh, yeah, is this uh, the head of HR? I don't have three to five years experience. So is there a, a hostess job available? Not a dishwasher? Hi, is this Steve Adams? Hi, Mr. Adams. Um, it's Jane McCormick. I interned for you a few years ago. Yes, it was under Susan. Oh, no, I, I didn't know about that. Um, so, actually, Mr. Adams, I'm calling because I am looking for another job, and I was hoping that... Right, yes. Yes, I understand that you're not hiring, um, but I was hoping that once you saw my new resume that you would... Right. Right. Um, thank you for your time. Oh. 
Jane, where have you been? We've all been worried sick about you. Uh, I've been relaxing. Uh-huh. Okay, um, this isn't working. So you're gonna take a shower, and again, get dressed, and then we're gonna go to a coffee shop, and we're gonna get you a job. <laughs> but Angie, why don't we just- Get cute, get your laptop, so we can get to work. Angie, now. <laughs> Awesome. These look great. Thanks, Riley. All right, cold brews for us, because we're gonna need it. All right, what kind of jobs are you interested in? I don't know. I'm into this coffee. Is the coffee gonna hire you? No, let's get to work. Are you finding any job postings yet? Nothing I haven't already applied to. All right, well, I just finished my LinkedIn. You wanna take a peek? Sure. Ta-da! Angie's looks great, but this picture over here is a little outdated. It barely looks like you. All right, Debbie Downer. That that picture still looks like me. I mean, besides like my hair and how old I am. But photographers are so expensive nowadays. Anyway, there's no way I can afford that. Um. Why don't Why don't I Why don't I take your picture? Okay. Thanks. Oh my gosh, these are, these are really good. <laughs> yes. Okay, um, wow, all right. I forgot how much I love this. We have a boutique garage, very vintage feeling, you know? Um, yes. Yes, I offer a variety of backdrop colors. I have blue and gray and uh, magenta. All right, let's get this look. Purse, other arm, great. Love that, keep it, keep it going. Um, let's get this next look ready. Looking good. Jane, hi. Hello, Miss Monroe, it's so nice to meet you. Oh, you too, call me Valerie. Here, have a seat. All right, let's take a look. Beautiful. Jane, I'm not going to lie, I didn't fully know what to expect. But these are incredible. Yeah, I love them. I want to do a cover option and I'd like to do a four page spread with this model specifically. Is that doable? Um, yes, yes, absolutely. Good. Yeah, I'm in love. This is going to make a beautiful June cover. Congratulations. Valerie, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. We'll be in touch. Great. Will you get me Natalie, please? Oh my gosh, Hi. what are you doing Hi. here? Um, I just got off a meeting on the 12th floor. We were finalizing pictures for my June cover. Wow, I had no idea you were into photography. That is amazing. Thank you so much, yeah. Um, well, this is me. <laughs> hey, Carrie. Hmm. Thank you. We've all watched Lisa Kudrow play her role as Phoebe Buffay on Friends for years. But very few know that initially she landed a role on the show Fraser, from which she was fired, which actually gave her the opportunity to be in Friends. Can you imagine if she never got fired? When things go wrong, we think everything is over, when truly, it is just a new beginning. 
A rejection, a failure, a door closed is not the end. Sometimes it can be the best thing that ever happened to us. I was rejected from 40 companies. I was turned down by 10 media companies before I ever made a video. A well-known podcast network pulled out two weeks before I launched because they said it wouldn't be a big podcast. I was told I was too young to help people. I was told I was too old to be in media. I was told no one would come on my podcast. I was told the market was too saturated. I was told it was too early. And I was told it was too late. Opinions are just opportunities for growth. So be grateful and do it anyway. A rejection stops you from settling for less than you deserve. A failure is the universe's way of saying, stop focusing on less. Don't be sad it didn't work out. Be grateful it didn't work out. If you want even more videos like this one, click on the boxes over here. Now, I'm really excited to let you know that you can now pre-order my new book, Think Like a Monk, and you can click here right now to do that. Pre-order it today.